Hi, I'm Robert from Northline Express, and we're going to talk about chimney liner and which liner type is best for you. We have the do-it-yourself chimney liner here, and it comes in two varieties, uh, multiple sizes, but two basic different varieties. One is a smooth wall, and it's a double construction. The other liner is a single wall construction, and it's corrugated. So the difference being that the corrugated is less expensive. Uh, it's also able to be field ovalized. In other words, you can squish that and get it past your damper. You can also get the extra section here if you like and, and make the transition without having to ovalize that yourself on both models. The smooth wall is actually double wall construction, has an inner and an outer wall, and the inside is very smooth. Because of that, it's a heavier pipe. You can't really squeeze that down to get it ovalized if you have to get past your damper. So you would have to go uh, with this if uh, you have to get past your damper and you can't break that out. So because of the smooth wall construction, it makes it a lot easier to clean than the corrugated style, which is rough on the inside. You're gonna get a little bit more creosote buildup on that. And because it's a single wall construction versus a double wall construction, this will stay a little bit warmer and reduce your creosote up to 20% or improve your draft by 20%. So because it's smooth, the smoke is gonna go up there, uh, up your chimney a lot better, a lot easier, and it's going to uh, improve your draft. So that's what the goal is here. We highly recommend the double wall chimney over the corrugated. Uh, however, that's a good choice if you're looking to save money. Okay, once you've chosen which liner you need, next you need to choose your kit. Now, the kits come with two different adapters. One is a T adapter, and this is designed for a wood stove or fireplace insert that has a rear vent. So this would go into your wood stove, and then your liner connects to the top, and it has a T clean out on the bottom. You would pick that kit with the T if you have a rear vent stove. If you have a top vent or an angled vent wood stove or fireplace insert, you pick the one with this type of adapter in it stovetop adapter and this goes down into your wood stove your liner goes into here you tighten up the clamp and you're done so it's really simple you pick which liner you want you pick the kit that you want and do it yourself we're going to show you how in our next video i hope you enjoyed this section and you've learned a little bit about the different types of liners see us see our video next on how to install chimney liners